I say hello to my in-studio guest to kick off hour number three. Never met uh, you, sir, but yeah. a pleasure to have you nice here in you. person for Thank the first time. Me. Quarterback of the Pittsburgh Steelers, Mason Rudolph. Good to see you here on the program. Appreciate How are you? Thanks, thanks, Rich. Thanks for having Good me Good to on. see you here, man. Yeah, you too. So um, what's going on in your world? What do you Not got? Not much. Um, do, you live, in, do you live out here? In the offseason, I'll spend some time out here training uh, down in, in Newport Beach. And, um, okay. You know, there's, there's not a bad place to be this time of year. At all. Uh, back and forth from Pitt. So, yeah, trying to get better, trying to fine-tune some things. Okay. Fundamental-wise. All right. Uh, yeah. How do you do that in the middle of March? Like, what do you, like, uh, what do, you do? Throwing, just just uh, working on, you know, things like arm slot, throwing on the run, nuanced things. Okay. Um, I think you don't have a lot of time during the season to always work on the fundamentals, your, your game plan, and then you're, and you're watching film. And so I like this time of year to kind of, you know, pay more attention to those things. How much better would you be if you get every rep? Every rep? Every rep. Uh, I think experience is, the, experience is the biggest teacher, right? So um, I got a lot of practice reps this year, actually. Ben, right. um, he, sometimes he would practice half Thursday, you know, Friday sometimes. Okay. So I'd have the Wednesday, Thursday reps to, you know, keep myself sharp right. in, in case, you know, I needed to be sharp. Well, I don't want to. I don't want to put. I. I feel like I might have just put you on the spot a little bit right there. Put me on the spot. No, no, no it's okay. No, yeah. it's all right. It's all right because you know I don't want to. You know, have you come across as saying that you you deserve more reps or anything like oh, that? Oh no, no, no. You just asked me, so I said reps are great. Reps are who, great. Who wouldn't want reps? Okay. Yeah. I I will take the reps. No doubt. I would. I look. I would be much re- better doing re- like we had. Uh, Trey Lance on uh, the okay. week of the Super Bowl, okay? And he's just like, yeah, if I had more reps, I'd be better. Yeah. And people are saying you're not. he, he might not be that guy. Yeah. So what do you think your status is for the Steelers as you and I are sitting here yeah. right now, Mason? My Rudolph? status is uh, you know, finally having the ability to compete to be the starting quarterback. So mm-hmm. um, I'm excited about that. You know, I, uh, I think there's a lot to be excited about the pieces around us. Um, you know, we've, we've added some – Bolstered the O line. Um, okay, got a couple of great young receivers. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, a young running back who's a workhorse. So, uh, lots to be excited What's about. What's your relationship with Tomlin like? How great. Much? He's uh, he's he's had my back. You know, for a long time, and and uh, we have a lot of informal conversations that are fun. He's he's a master of psychology. What do you mean? He he's got relationships. We've all been on teams where coaches are CEOs, and mm-hmm. they kind of hang back in the shadows, and he. Yes. Does a great job of uh, connecting. To me, he's asking you, "Hey, how's your brother doing? Uh, you know, Mason in Hollywood. How's 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 his acting?" So he he's just uh, master psychology, as I said, and and very personal with his players. Okay, so, so he yeah. kind of messes with your head a little bit. A little, as you no, saying? no. Well, well, we we both give each other crap. Well, how kinda, do you how do you give Mike Tomlin crap? Um, off like, uh, give me no, an example. I mean, he, well, he'll he'll. Uh, you know, he'll talk about uh, on those days where I would get the reps okay. Wednesday, Thursday. Yeah. Um, you know, let's go, Rudolph. This is your day. You know, this is this is your this is Ben will always wear a, a, a ball cap mm-hmm. in practice, uh, mm-hmm. and he'll go through individual period with just a with just a hat on instead okay. of the helmet. Mm-hmm. And so that's just what we did. We all started wearing ball caps. You know, when I got here, mm-hmm. older guys, quarterbacks, and and um, so I'll, I'll I'll mess with them, put the ball cap on just for a little bit. But I'll put the helmet on quickly, and he'll say, "Oh, you got your you got your ball cap on today, Rudolph. You mm-hmm. think it's your day?" Mm-hmm. So, it's, so that's uh, your way of messing. Yeah, we time. just he, it's we got a great relationship. Okay, that's cool. So your brother's an actor? I didn't know. Yes, he's uh he played college football at Clemson actually, and and uh, has been out here in Hollywood for about a year now. What's he doing? Where do I uh, see? He Is did he, a, he did a movie with Lifetime. He did a Lifetime movie about six months ago this fall, and, and he did a uh, Lifetime movie. He nice. did. Can you IMDb his? Uh, sure. It's, what's his? Yeah, what's your brother's name? Logan Rudolph. Logan. Yeah. Rudolph. Yeah. See, give me, give me his, because you know I've I've played various roles Have myself. You, okay. yeah. yeah. Uh, as male reporter in a CSI Miami. Okay. Great headshot. Um, what'd yeah. you say? He's got a great headshot. I mean, uh, yeah. With killer rivalry was that the name? Yeah, of that's it? that's the one. There you go. So. It's in post production. It hasn't come out yet. It hasn't oh. come out yet. Yeah. It sounds like a. A lifetime movie. A lifetime movie. Like yeah. somebody's that they're going at each other yeah. and yeah. Is he, you want the description here? Yes, please. All right, here we go. Give me the give me uh, the Charlie and Annika are volleyball rivals from opposing teams. Volleyball. Oh, th- so it's a killer as an as a shot. Yeah, there you go. Not like every even. year the two teams pull pranks on each other, but things start to get out of hand <laughs> when Annika's volleyball partner is found dead. Oh no. Is that Logan? I think he gets I think he gets set up. <laughs> For the murder. <laughs> is he? Oh, oh I see. Yeah. But he's not like out framed. by page five. He gets framed. Oh, yeah, okay. no. no yeah. He's not the one who goes. He's not the saying. murderer, no. No, he's not the victim, I'm saying. He's, he's not the victim. Because we can't no, have no, him. He, no, we he stays have, alive. We, okay. He stays we alive. We can't have him out in five minutes. No, we can't. It wouldn't be good. That's okay. great. 
Yeah? This is great. All right. We'll take a look at that. Fantastic. Yeah. See, now we're promoting your brother here on go. the program. Appreciate it. Okay. Uh, you got it. <laughs> Checks in the mail. You got it. Makes it like more about me, Rich. No, no, it's okay. It's all good. Yeah. So, uh, all right. Uh, I, we, we play a game here called Start, Bench, Cut, Mason. Yeah. Okay. Um, where we give you three options. Okay. You have to start one. You have to bench one. You have to cut one. All right. Okay. It's sort of like that, you know what, marry, kill yes. game. Okay, you, <laughs> you pretty much got that. Familiar. You're familiar with that from your old Oklahoma State days and things I like am, that? I am. Okay, very good. All right, here we go. Uh, Mike, do you have the ability to play this? Because I want to show Mason. Yes. We, like uh, the Lifetime movie, his brother was going to have uh, killer production value. Okay, go ahead and hit it. Right it's there. time. Start. Start now. Bench. Just sit down and be quiet. Or cut. Okay, Duh. Okay. here we go. Uh, Mason Rudolph, first up, best football hair. Okay, best football, best football hair. hair. Here we go. Start, bench, cut. I give you three. Probably okay. Mike Gundy, Troy Polamalu, Kevin Green. Yeah, Steeler um, legend, Kev, two I, Steeler Hall I, of Fame I, legends, and then of course the man who is no longer forty. What is he? Fifty something? He's now? in his fifties. Okay, now. Mike yeah, Gundy, yeah. your former college yeah. coach, now the mullet. Well, Mike Gundy never had a Head and Shoulders commercial. Okay, so I got to go Troy. So you're going to start him. Start Troy. Who are you you um, bench. I mean, I'm. A, I, 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 my gun is a great friend of mine and lifelong uh -huh. friend and mentor. So yes, um, but I'm probably going to get in trouble with the Steeler community. You have if to I, go home. I, you have to go home. Yes. Yeah, I, I'd say, uh, I'd say we'll, uh, we'll, we'll, you know, we'll, 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 we'll bench Mike. Okay. And we'll, and we'll cut KG. Oh so. my oh. gosh! You can't even cut his own coach. <laughs> So, so Gundy, you and Gundy are still tight. We are. And yeah. How, how often do you guys close. talk? How often do you guys uh, talk? You know, he's. Very busy during the season. We'll, we'll check in with each other, you know, every, every once every couple of weeks. Okay. So, um, he's, uh, yeah, had a, had a, anytime you have a coach who was the alma mater, you know, played at his alma mater and yeah. played quarterback, sure. I think it was very valuable for me. Where does his mullet come from? Uh, where did that mullet come where from? Where did his mullet come from? Where did it know. come from? You know, one day he came into practice and had it and uh, kept, kept <laughs> working it. Kept, kept rocking it. I think did you he, never <laughs> say anything to him? I did. Uh -oh. I, I liked it. I mean, I, I, uh, <laughs> My nickname for him is Big Daddy. Oh, and, uh, okay. <laughs> and so I'd say, Big Daddy, I think it's time maybe we get a little trim. Yes. You know, it's <laughs> getting out of hand. And? And uh, he listened. I mean, he eventually cut He trimmed it. I think he had it my my senior year only. I okay. Know, I don't know. I'm not sure. But either one or two years. But he trimmed it eventually. It was after I left. But okay. He trimmed it. All right. Yeah. All right. Next one. Uh, <laughs> next one. Here's another one for, for Mason Rudolph. Start bench cut. Best Pittsburgh cuisine. Peppy's number seven, which is the Rothless Burger. Yeah. Uh, Promanti's Steak Sandwich or uh, Allegheny's uh, Sandwich Shop Roast Beef. What do you got for me? Yeah, I got to go. Start bench cut. Start Promanti's. That's a Pittsburgh staple. Of course. Love it. Big time favorite. Okay. Uh, Pepe's. Pepe's rather. Yeah. Uh, we'll bench and then we'll cut Allegheny. You're going to cut. Okay. You, you're going to we'll bench the, the Rothless Burger? Have you ever had the Roethlisberger? I have not had it, but I've been to Peppy's. Okay, it's, it's, it's great. <laughs> okay, so I need to I need to have the the Roethlisberger at some. Do you really, or are you just saying that? No, I'm I'm just saying that. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I but has I has Ben ever? Do you know if Ben has Ben ever had a Roethlisberger? I'm sure he has. I, I don't know that for a fact, but okay. I would. Wouldn't you have a sandwich if it was named after you? You know what? I would not if it was not what I'd like. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like they'd have to you want name input. Huh? You want, in, you want input yeah. on what yeah. the sandwich is. Damn straight. Yeah. yeah, of course. What would the Eisen sandwich be? Yeah. Oh, boy. Yeah, what would the... What would be the Eisen sandwich? It would have to be some sort of an Italian concoction. Ooh, it would right. have to have some red sauce. Meatball. It would have to have, yeah, meat, oh, man, have to have meatballs, a chicken yeah. parm with yeah. maybe some meatballs on top, Ooh, like, like a big old... Like you're thinking. Yeah, yeah, a beef chicken situation. Yeah. Of I course, like breaded uh, yeah. with yeah. the bread. Uh, so it's multi-breaded. <laughs> Multi-layers of the bread. A lot of gluten. A lot of gluten. Well, I mean, I've, look, lot at of, me. look at me. A lot of inflammation. Me, please. Yeah. Uh, I mean, that's my problem. Yeah. I'm too inflamed. <laughs> what's what's the Rudolph? Well, yeah, what's what's the Rudolph? Uh, Should we get something on the menu at Permanti's yeah, let's or do that beef? Let's do this. gone. Yeah, he's, gone. he's out. He's out. He's out. Rudolph's in. Off His walking menu. boot has left town. <laughs> and now it's it's the Rudolph sandwich Come time. Let's go. What do we got? What do we got? You know, I'd say probably... Come on! Probably, a, probably a, like a like a cheesesteak. I'm not going to say Philly oh, cheesesteak. You can't. Name you them. can't. So oh like God. a cheesesteak, a, a Pittsburgh cheesesteak. What does that sound like? So, so what is it? Like a, a beef? Is it beef? Yeah, shredded beef. Okay. Some peppers and there's some onions. Okay. 
um, maybe some tomatoes. Okay. Ooh. So we'll we'll, we'll 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 throw a little health in there. Okay. With the meat, and uh, we'll throw some red sauce in there okay. too. Yeah, okay. So sauce. Sauce. Like what do we call it? A Mason burger or what is it? A Rudolph burger? Ooh, no, Rudolph. Rudolph. It's the, no, it's the, the Pittsburgh. It's the Pittsburgh cheesesteak. Okay. The Ooh. Pittsburgh okay. cheesesteak. All right. Let's get permanent. send it on. Let's send it on. All right, we got one last one here. This is this is a good one. Rich Start is proud bench of this cut. One. Mason, yeah. just no, heads no, no, up. No, stop, Rich is stop, proud of this stop. one. No, no, I'm not proud of it. I'm actually, you know, here we go. Favorite crown. Start bench cut. Crown jewels of England, crown royal whiskey, or the crown of your own helmet. Mason Rudolph. Um, Do you start bench or cut one? Well, you know what I'm cutting. So. <laughs> um, no, I, I'd say uh, we're starting. We're starting crown. We're okay. starting crown royal. Crown royal is uh, a start. Start, okay. and we're benching jewels, and we are cutting the helmet as we previously <laughs> said. So, yes. Yeah, that was good. Yeah, that was good. You even you even approved that, that one. You good. for the cap. That was yeah. Good. <laughs> <laughs> Just wanted to throw that one out. The great yeah. start bench cut. That was, that was, actually, that was very excellent. Good. That was very good. Excellent. All right. So now you came out of the um, uh, the green room and you heard my yeah. conversation with Christian Kirk yeah. in hour yeah. number two about Instagram aesthetics. The, the aesthetics. <laughs> what? Because he was saying that he's all about the aesthetics of his Instagram. Yeah. I don't understand it's what a buzzword, that, right? Well, because you know? my son uses it all the time. He's like, he said that's yeah. so aesthetic. This is yeah. aesthetic and what have you. Do. What is it? I don't understand. Do you you gave a good de definition, just pleasing to the eye. Okay. Any, anything that may be pleasing to the eye. But it's my photographs. I mean, like, how, do, how does one, you know, I, I, see. I think you're pleasing to the eye. I checked out your profile. Bless you, you know, sir. You, you, were, you had some thank GQ you. material in there. Do I? You had some suit pictures that you were, you know. Looking, yeah, I did look, feel You look that. sharp. Okay, thank you. That's why I asked you what. You know what? What what designer you wear? I said, okay, hey, thank you. So you look oh. like a Tom Ford guy. <laughs> no, Rich. I'm, a, I'm actually if, now that you've asked, uh, yeah. uh, Brunello Cuccinelli. Oh wow. Okay. What about you? Because I see, because you, Touché. your, 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 I see your Instagram because yeah. I, because I knew that you were going to be busting my balls yeah. about mine. Yeah. So I looked at yours and yeah. you've got, it's a lot of you coming off of the plane with Goodwill. your bag, yeah. you know, yeah. and what is it? Goodwill. What does that mean? What do you mean? Like the, the the Goodwill store where yeah. you go and you, you buy old stuff. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. You look. No, you look. Okay, it took you a minute. No, you sir. Minute. No, sir. No, sir. No, I, yeah. You look outfitted. Oh. Rich, you're too kind. I'd say. Uh, I mean, this this one. If you just want to go to Mason's page, yeah. it's uh, Rudolph Two Mason. The fifth one down. You look like James Bond. Like I'm not gonna lie. The black suit oh. and the white shirt. Well, what, yeah. what bag is that? Is that a Gucci or Louis, Va uh, Louis bag? You got? I'd say Louis bag, and then and then um, I usually I have some suit. The suit's Zania. I try to stay in the Zania. Oh, you're Zania. Oh, yeah. oh, look at that man. man. My man's looking sharp. Oh. Golly. Yeah. And, and let's, you know, we, let's let's get rid of that. Let's pull up a rich. Let's pull up one of those rich. No, 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 You're in the seat right now. The course, game it's, was a, it's a nice flex that you're not also going through security there. That looks like a nice oh. FBO yeah. out there. Oh, that's how you travel. I'm sure. You're straight on the PJ. Yeah. You step off the step off the thing and right into the suburban. That's me. His feet never touch the ground. That's me. That's me. No, I don't do I don't do play by play. I'm a studio. Uh, hey, host. Hey, different, hey, different, hey, different whole uh, way of traveling now in the NFL. Yeah. But no, I, that, oh, very nice. So Zenia, okay. Let's get. And what do you yeah. what do you got on today? What are you wearing today? Uh, what do you got today? You're looking you know, put together. I, well, thank you. I, You're welcome. Uh, yeah, some some Zenia items and some some jeans. Okay, you know, nothing nothing too crazy. <laughs> I love it. I didn't, I didn't want to. Uh, yeah, I, wanted to be, I wanted to be relatively I mean, casual for you today. He's like yeah, you can feel the heat from the cheeks over here. Like he's very like uncomfortable talking about this. <laughs> <laughs> you can feel the heat from the cheeks. It's, tough. it's wow. tough to it's tough to stay humble when no, you're stumping when you're stunting on the Rich Eisen show, yeah, right? Yeah, no, Mason. No the stunting. more you mention them, you know that that's the more packages that come to the crib in a few right. days. You know. Oh so. yeah, they, there you go. That's some free pub. You know. And by the way, was it Lamont Restaurant? Is that the one we Altius. were thinking. It was Altius. Altius, okay. I just remember it, yeah. What, is it, what are we talking about here? A restaurant. Uh, res my man's from Pittsburgh. And, yes. And uh, we were talking about a, a restaurant earlier and, and uh, Altius. Altius. Great spot. Well, he's... Yeah. Oh, here he goes, Mason. Here he goes. No, he's, he's not... I mean, he's from Altoona. You know what I mean? Okay, well, he told me Pittsburgh. Right? Well, so, yeah. I, yeah, I, I, mean, I was born and raised in Altoona. I right, grew up in Pittsburgh, okay. as I like to say, and then I moved to L.A. What do you, when you say, I like to Accounts. say, what does that mean, as you like to say? Well, uh, like I've said it before. Okay. Like, you know. So, do you, uh, he, he, he says he's from the East Coast. Do you consider Pittsburgh an East Coast town? It's from the East. 
<laughs> oh, Co- I mean, yeah. like a guy it's from lovely. South Carolina who went to the heartland of this country before starring in Pittsburgh, PA. Yeah. It's East Coast, Mason. Here it's, we go. It's, it's East Coast time zone. It's, it's okay, yeah, Eastern it's time zone. So that's it's, all that's the same. Is. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right, so I don't know what we've accomplished with my Instagram account <laughs> yeah. other than the fact that I need to be more aesthetic. I don't know what that means. So, it's yeah. my life. If it's not aesthetic, you know, I mean, yeah. okay. You only get one of them. Okay. Also, Mason, be, be honest. You. Nobody is taking down any of your Oklahoma State records for a long time, right? Oh, I don't know. They're, they're, well, the, the kid there that uh, Spencer's, he's done a good job. So he, he, I think he's got another year. So he may be, you know, I don't know. We'll see. But uh, yeah, you've doubled them up in passing yards. I mean, uh, don't, don't be humble here, bro. Like 13,600 <laughs> career yards. You're 4,400 clear of Brandon Whedon and 92 career touchdowns. Brandon yeah, Whedon had the kind of had the two years because he played baseball. Right? Yeah, that's right. right. So then he came yeah, he's out, also so. what? He was 35 he was when he also, graduated, right? He's like 28. He was, yeah, 20. was, like 20. he was 62 <laughs> in the ARP yeah. card when he graduated. <laughs> yeah. I think. Thanks for coming in, man. Yeah, thank I you. appreciate it. Appreciate Hope it. you enjoyed the experience. Yeah, it's great. Okay. Oh, thank you so Very much. good. Good luck to you in, uh, in your competing in Latrobe, right? Thank you. Okay. Yeah. And, forward to and it. Is that what they've told you? You're competing yes. for this job? Yes, that's what, that's what they've told me, and, okay. and that's that's the way I'm going to approach it. Attaboy. That's yeah. what's up. Okay. Let's Thanks, go. Mason Rudolph. Congratulations yeah. on you, everything Rich. going on and you being as aesthetic as you are in person as you are on your Rich. Instagram. You, so. you, are the, you are the epitome of uh, I appreciate that. Thank you, sir. Greatly appreciate that. That is Mason Rudolph here on The Rich Eisen Show. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.